past like even when I'm at my worst. I'ma check my ways up, I'ma always put you first. All these other girls, I'ma leave them at the curve. And that's my word. What's, What's up, up Cupid? It's your boy Maya. And it's your girl Rose. And, and welcome, welcome back to, to the Love Club. Club. And today we have a vlog day. So we always get asked to do a lot of vlogs, but like with quarantine and everything, we don't be knowing what to vlog because there's only but so much we'll be doing. But this weekend, we actually have a little weekend getaway. So we are in the city. Yes. Live. You're right now. Like, what's this background? This is a hotel background. We're not home right now. Yeah, we're not home right now. And if you're probably wondering why my arm is like this, because I'm holding the curtain, because if I let it go, it's going to cover the camera. So I got to hold it. My arm is starting to hurt. Y'all want to see our view, though? Watch this. We are high up right now. We got the Empire, Empire State, State Building. Building in the cut. Our room is a little messy right now, but don't mind it, y'all. It's really, oh man. We just finished nah, getting nah, nah. ready. <laughs> we gotta fix it up in here. <laughs> so we gonna give y'all a quick little tour. Hey, who that? Team Maya. So this is our bed, don't you know? And we, we just tried to fix it up. We got this thing going on right here. I really like this because if you turn on this light, and you twist these, they're like little night lights Starlight. on Moonlight. each side. If you turn on like this light right here, these lights come on. Ooh, so we got some nice lighting going on in here. TV. This is the TV right there. You know, you got a little refrigerator, a safe, some snacks and drinks right there. We got the bathroom now the bathroom here. is my favorite part. We got the bathroom over here, the glass shower. Glass shower with the hold up. This Ceiling room. shower head, okay. Wait, this towel is about to fall. And then on over here, we got the filter changing light. <laughs> Chill, stop playing. <laughs> and yeah, guys, it's a pretty little small, cute hotel room. I'm really feeling it. We needed this weekend getaway. But basically, the reason of this vlog is really just to show you guys like how does Manhattan look after this whole crazy aftermath of the looting and the rioting and everything. So that's what we're about to go do. We're about to go show you guys how everything looks outside. Doesn't he look so cute looking? Yo guys, I'm not gonna lie. I'm planning on cutting my hair off. I'm really gonna get a, I don't know, but I'm gonna show y'all on my Instagram and Snapchat. Over, I'm not with it. I don't like the long hair no more. That's why you guys need to follow us on Instagram. All of our social medias are always on the description below, so you can keep up with us. We're always doing polls and we're always asking questions. We like to be like connected with you guys. So, yeah. but I really don't want to cut his hair off. Nah, I don't. I'm not feeling it no more. I'm really not. But I understand that he needs something new because me being a girl, I always feel like I need something new too. Whether I dye my hair, cut my hair get a new piercing. Yep. So I support whatever he decides. You better. But before we get into this video, make sure you like, comment, and, and subscribe. subscribe. So we have some matching Black Panther face masks. It looks you like it? My aunt, <laughs> my aunt Sheila made it for us. So shout out to her. They have air filters and everything in them. Yep, this is fire, your auntie. <laughs> and right now we're just walking. We're about to go to Fifth Ave. So from here, you can see all the boards that's covering every store because they was robbed. Yeah. Our um, hotel receptionist told us that like, they didn't have to worry about anything when everything was going on, but across the street, there's like a DJ place where they probably like, what do you, what do you think they have a DJ place in? They got like a whole bunch of equipment. Yeah, probably places. like mixers and stuff like that. And they went to town on that store, so. Yeah, they broke it down. And you see the and boards right here. Boards here. Oh my God, there's a Capital One bank right here. So you already know what was going down. Oh man, we on Fifth Ave right now. I really hate wearing these masks. Like I can't wait for it to be 
for all of this to just blow over. You see the floors all through here. So remember guys, guys, I'm talking to guys only. If you are walking with your girlfriend or a girl that you like, walk on the outside. Always. And she walks on the inside. Because like for us, if we walk on the outside, that means that a boy is selling us. Yep. So that's why girls should always be on the inside of the street and the men should always be on the outside of the street. And I feel like, do you feel more protected? Yeah, I feel more protected too because like, God forbid if there was a car accident, like he's gonna get hit first. Damn! Oh. <laughs> but like not in a bad way, like I don't mean it in a bad way. Like even when we sleep in the bed, like I like for him to be closer to the door than me. Cause like you have to protect me. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't I mean you, it baby. in a bad way. I got you. <laughs> but look at all of these um boards and stuff everywhere. Damn. It's just crazy. How do you guys feel about the looting and the rioting? I know it's for um, a good purpose and everything, but like, how do you feel about it? I just want to know. Yeah, comment down below your like input on everything that's going on. Cause we like to know, you know? We're not um, biased. We like to hear everybody's side and you know, just try to get a conception from everybody and how they feel. I wonder what this building here is because they are not playing no games. They have their whole building boarded up. Even behind us. Oh crap, here too. This is the CVS though, Wow. So we out here, we just taking a nice little walk. Our mask looks so cute. You like it? Yeah. I like that we have matching ones, it's cute. We always twin it for everything. Look, and look at this. My oh, baby look gorgeous today. Thank See you. out here blinging. <laughs> You're sexy. This is the chain you got You're me. Beautiful. Valentine's Day. Really? Mm. You keep giving me these masks to forehead kisses. I'll give you real kisses later. I want real kisses. We're gonna get real quick. Hmm, let me check something out real quick. And now we have arrived to Pinkberry. Oh my god! Pinkberry. <laughs> See, they didn't even know where we were going. I was just I walking. thought we were just taking a walk. They're open too, babe. Let's oh get my it. God. How you feel? Ooh, ooh, ooh. But there's a lot of music going on in here, so we'll show you guys what we got. Pinkberry is an ice cream store. Frozen yogurt. Yeah, it's a frozen yogurt place. That's Rose Loves. So we'll see you on the few. Jeremiah always has something up his sleeve. You're on the wrong side. I know, I'm just hiding behind the camera. Ah! I always got something up my sleeve. Look at I'm that. So Some what we got, Some what we got. Put the camera up. All right. Peanut butter ice cream, whipped cream, strawberries. It's not ice cream. Ah. What is it? Frozen yogurt. Right, I got peanut butter, frozen yogurt, cheesecake, strawberry, strawberry drizzle, cookies and cream, and whipped cream and a nice little waffle cookie and i got the original flavor which is a sweet tart i got some chocolate crunch mangoes mochi strawberries and caramel drizzle Ooh. <laughs> a lot of places are closed down but right now we're walking back to the hotel and we also, order food yeah we also ordered some food and I already finished my ice cream. Rose, you know she take a million years to finish anything. And yeah, I know my mask is a little crooked and all that, but don't mind. It's not my fault Maya eats super fast, okay? Nah. He literally finished 
his in like a minute. No. Yes. I'll say like no. Five it minutes. was a minute. It was five like minutes. two minutes. Five minutes. Eat the goddamn ice cream. Not <laughs> no, ice cream. Oh my god, the frozen yogurt. Same thing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Baby got a hole in her mouth. Uh oh. <laughs> Back inside the hotel, and I'm about to change my clothes because it's hot as hell outside. So we're gonna wait for the food, and then we're gonna go back outside after we eat. Yeah, take some pictures. I to change my outfit. It was way too hot outside. Yeah, it was. But our food just got here, so this is a gouda smoked bacon mac and cheese. This is called street tacos. We got some lemonades, and we got some rosé wine. And we also have some Parmesan french fries. What? What? <laughs> so, we're just eating now. How does it taste? Very cheesy. Mm. So we paid like $70 for all this food. It was terrible. And Maya's not really feeling it. Look at this. Street tacos. I'm thinking there's gonna come with like six of them. Two tacos. Then. And how much did that cost? This was $18 right here for two tacos. Then this was $15 for macaroni and cheese from a box. French fries, $9. And then we got. Let me show you something. This lemonade, three dollars. Well, that's actually like okay. We got two of them. Put it over there. And then we got this, which was twelve dollars. Didn't even come no, to the top. No, it wasn't twelve dollars. Yes, it was. That was the one that used to cost eighteen dollars. Remember, you said this will last you all day, probably, because it cost eighteen dollars. Yeah, well, that's terrible. And then it was supposed to come with another soda, and they didn't even give it. So, do not order from this place. It's called Cafeteria. Some trash. Well, I'm trying to make the best out of it. But so we kind of want to like. This was like a vlog. But we're kind of like making it into a mukbang now since we're eating. But like, what should we talk about? What do you want to talk about? Oh, we can talk about how we got a whole bunch of clothes and stuff. Huh? Remember how we got a lot of clothes? You said you want to give it away. Oh, yeah. So, right now, well, yesterday we finally went back to my school to go pick up the rest of my like stuff, which was like my clothes, my sneakers. We finally got our ring light, our rug. It was a lot of stuff that I had back in school that we're gonna like decorate our room with. So we're gonna like change our room around again. We're gonna paint our room. And we also wanted to give away a lot of our clothes. Well, like we have some name brand, like good quality that we'll probably like sell for a really like low price. Like it will make it affordable and expensive. But like if there's anyone in need, we also wanna give away the clothes as well. So definitely go follow us on Instagram to be updated with that because that's where we're going to be like posting and selling it at. And we have a lot of clothes, like a lot of clothes. And like we are both like clothes hoarders. So we have clothes that we've had like for years and that like we don't even really use, but like we, we don't want to throw it out either. So that's going to be like what we're going to be selling or giving away. So definitely follow us on Instagram for that. Of course, you would be the one to make the mess on the bed. I have a whole bunch of Adidas shirts that I was going to wear. Like, you know, the sports ones? That has the stripes and little designs on it. Mm -hmm. My dad don't even wear it. And I have... Well, like, my stuff isn't really so much name brand. But it's, like, from H&M, Forever 21, Fashion Nova, places like that. And all girls love those places, so... But he has, like, Nike, Adidas. Yeah. And he always like gives me his clothes, like the clothes that he don't really want no more. So I can wear like for pajamas. But regardless, that's still hoarding because it's still yeah. like 
in our drawers and we don't have like no space for our clothes so, so that's really why we're stuff. trying to get rid of yeah how does the taco taste? feels good it smells good but you can make better tacos but yeah guys i know we haven't been posting a lot but there's just been so much going on and we just been adjusting to everything that's going on and just you know we're trying to figure out ways to get money figure out ways to have fun yeah enjoying our time together because it's not impossible for us to get a job right now with all of this stuff happening not a lot of places are hiring and we're still trying to save up to get our car because living in Long Island is like impossible to move around unless you have a car. Exactly. So we have like all these little side hustles that we're doing. Check out our Instagrams, Snapchat. We post everything all the time. Hey, this food got me tired and I'm not even like, I'm seriously getting the items already. I always enjoy the food that we order and stuff like that. Not feeling it? This wine is mad hot. Taste it. I did taste it. It tastes nasty because it's hot as fuck. Put it in the fridge. But come on now, they gotta do a way better job than this. I think we're gonna name this video Eating from the Worst Restaurant in Manhattan. There's so many. Blog. I mean, Plus, um, the eating from the worst restaurant in Manhattan, mukbang slash vlog. Come on, let's take a picture of all the stuff for our thumbnail. BRB, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Rose said that we gonna call the place and tell them that they had our buttholes doodling at, at the freaking walls and our shit looked like a sprinkler. <laughs> <laughs> We gotta call the place right now. What's up? <laughs> Bad. You guys are the worst store ever. You have my ass at the fucking walls. What? What did you put in your macaroni and cheese? This shit is disgusting. Hello? Ah, oh, you have my ass at the fucking sprinkler. <laughs> Disgusting. Uh, it wasn't disgusting. Yo, nah, the crazy part is you said, What did you put in the neck right here? She said, Ah, oh, <laughs> what did you put in here? So let's take the camera close up. Like, look at this. It sounds good. It really right. smells good and it looks good and it sounds good. They calling back. <laughs> so we just came back outside again, but now Maya has his black mask. He's not matching with me no more. We still got matching shoes, don't worry. But we're about to go take some pictures. Before the sun goes down. Yeah, so we're gonna show you guys where we're gonna be at when we get there. So we're here at 34th Street right now, and we have this amazing billboard behind us. I really black love it. Matter. We over here taking selfies, taking nice pictures. Look at my ears because of my head. <laughs> They're sticking out, OD. <laughs> Black Lives Matter. Period. That's a fact. Hey guys, so we're back home as you can already see from the crazy background. We got um, all the roses stuff. Was yeah. There was, was cool. a, there was a lot going on, so we didn't finish the vlog. And we also got something else very new. We're just gonna show you one little sneak peek. Just yeah, one. One little sneak peek. Oh. That's all y'all can see. Oh. 
That's it. That's all you can see. Next video we're gonna show them. So stay tuned for our next vlog that we're we're gonna be filming tomorrow, and you guys will really get the introduction. She's waking up. We're whispering because she's sleeping right now. Yeah, we also have something young. That's right. That's right. Bestie in the cut, okay? It's a scary sight. <laughs> So yeah guys, we're gonna vlog tomorrow, but right now we're gonna finish this vlog off. So stay tuned. If you love us like we love you, you already know what you gotta do. You gotta smash that like button. Boom! Hit that comment section up. Boom! And tell your mother, tell your brother, tell your sister, tell your uncle, tell your mother, tell your brother, tell your sister, tell your uncle. Hey! hey.